Hey guys, welcome to Sketchbook January 2023 to March 2023. Let's have a look through, see what I got up to for the last couple of months. Well, I'm a die the Aegis. I went to all this trouble and wrote December 2022 on the cover and then I had a good think about it and realised it was actually January 2023 to March 2023. So I had to wash it all away as best I could. Didn't really get rid of all the red and go over it again. And this time I added a couple of little pink love hearts just to try and cover up the bits that I just couldn't get off. So let's jump in. Okay, well, I did make some nice stamps out of ordinary rubbers that you buy in a stationery shop, and that was a lot of fun. The candles on my dining room table made such a nice subject for study, and I loved showing how bright the flames were by darkening up the paint around them. A trip down to Kinvara, my local fishing village. I don't know if there's any fishing happening there anymore, but I really liked parking on the pier and drawing what I could see and making the little accent of the red. My fireplace in my studio, a trip to a cafe with my son Paddy, and I don't know why I didn't fill in the other side of the page. This is in one of the pubs in Galway City, and I just recorded the conversation in my brand new speech bubble template that I get a lot of fun out of, much more than I actually thought I would when I first got it. This is back to Kinvara, that little fishing village, and some kind of, I suppose, eyeballed perspective of the street. Well, in this particular page, I had to fill in a couple of empty pages where I'd started to sketch badly. So I did a cartoon on the left because I do like drawing cartoons, use that template. And on the right, well, let me tell you. Well, the good people at Schminke have asked me to come up with a palette of my own colours, if you don't mind. They're going to make a little set using my choice of colours, my picture on the front of the box. So here I am trying out their full paint range to see which ones I think would come in useful for various different sketching situations. So I have this group called Urban Sketchers Galway and we went out one Sunday and did some drawing. That was fun. And this is a bit of a sad drawing. It was basically done of my gym to do something with the page where I'd made a mistake of the of this drawing. And this was my second page where I'd made a mistake. You can see on the top right there's a piece of paper sort of stuck on. And that was where I finally managed to get it more or less as I had wanted it to, to be. And um, this is across the river from me in Galway. The less said about this one, the better. <laughs> this one is in a cafe, a frame within a frame is what I called it because I thought it made a lovely composition. This is out in um, County Wicklow. And in the Nat Natural History Museum in Dublin City, drawing the giant deer, which are just so cool couldn't resist doing these subjects, these little fish in jars of formaldehyde. And yes, I did give them speech bubbles. Going for a brisk walk in Bray one day in County Wicklow and I couldn't resist that fabulous scene of seagulls. Well, urban sketchers sketch anywhere and this is in the hospital waiting room. Back to Bray and drawn on the pebbly beach along the Bray Seafront and back to the Natural History Museum where I painted a raven, a stuffed raven having killed a hare. Here are some of my uh, traumas and so on as a child growing up in Bray. This is Bray Seafront and they're all written there. Um, OK, so I've started doing these big canvases and acrylics and I like to do a mock up beforehand. More cartoons, more cartoons of Reuben and me, my little fluffy dog. Just down the road from me, um, just one of the lovely roads. And on Valentine's Day, I did some nice little bickies. This was a quick one, just filling in while I was waiting for someone in Dublin City. Um, just a quick idea and more cartoons, more cartoons of me and my little dog. This one features my son, Paddy, as well. And I think you might have you might have seen this one on my YouTubes uh, down at the pier at the at my local shore at home, sketching at home on a Sunday morning. And last but not least, some tropical shells.